146. Two treble nine teams. Nine. Now this 120 it can be a lethal break of throw thing, but it's it's a bit odd when you need to do it to hold. Did this in the last leg for the shot at the 130, found a way through. This time he went ball ball. I'm surprised 62. with the success he had in the previous leg. 51. That's a very good observation because you can repeat what you've done. And, well, although he hasn't done it in this match, Humphreys has hit a double 16 many a time this year. What a way to get a break of throw. He needs another. What a great third, so casual. I like that he isn't over-involved in the nine effort. He's aware of it, certainly, and wants to do it, of course. But he didn't let it uh, sidetrack the fact that he wanted to leave a double after ten. Still waiting nine for our first perfect leg Joe of this tournament. 16. Scott Williams missed a dart for the nine. And the eleven darts will do for Joe Collins. A break Joe straight Collins. back. Fifth leg, Joe to throw first. 70. Yeah. Well, Joe has to get another treble 19 to leave double. He does. So pressure now on Humphreys. It's an opportunity, but it's still a pressure. Double top. Does not take the opportunity. Joe Cullen set it up perfectly to take the opening set here. Does so. Brilliant opening to this one. Both men averaging over a ton, but it's Cullen who takes set one. A single to the bullseye, leaves treble to single. Didn't get that treble. But he's going to get 20 for tops. Clatters into the dark. Now this could be huge. You love to take these sorts of outs when your opponent just missed a double or is on one even. It's a good pressure visit, though, because it's such a good opportunity. You might be nervous about missing it. Not Joe. Just love that. Thank Collins. you. Once again, the thrilling potential of a nine data. It is on. Oh, my word. He's hit three in his career. They've all come this year. It's no surprise. He's constantly getting chances. Both have been seven darts into a perfect leg. So, the question now becomes, will one of them get any further? Because it seems like a competition. 20. Ooh, a miss. And Joe Cullen could sweep the set here. He may look at double-double. No, he goes treble 16 for double. Yeah, that is a comfortable shot. It, it, it really does appeal to some players under pressure. Doesn't like it. He's having a move. And he's got to move again for double eight. And Luke Humphreys looking a little hot and bothered and Junior slightly confused that he's missed ten darts at double already, and he might find himself two sets down. Well, he should find himself two sets down. Joe will be beside himself if he doesn't get this double ten. He gets it and gets a two-set lead, and the three-tournament favourite is going to have to mount another comeback. 138. Not on this occasion. This is as a set where Cullen has the darts as well. Holding throw is enough for a 3-0 lead from here. And this is to hold his throw. Yeah, he kind of felt like he should have been able to land that last one on top there. It looked awkward, but he didn't think so. But Luke doesn't think that's awkward. Second leg, Luke to throw And that's uh, exactly what Luke needed. So you, you have to think, and it forces that on you, and you have to be able to deal with these things. Every leg brings permutations, but Joe Cullen is hitting back. On from a little 11 dart up. Beautiful. 34, Jerry Ball 54. That leaves tops. Beautiful guide, line, uses it, breaks straight back. Third 
cruising his way back into contention in this leg. Humphreys, dangerous on the treble. Oh, good answer in coming here. Wow. That means Luke must get this done. He'll get one dart at tops. One dart is all he needs. Well, in this set, Cullen's hit 180s in every single leg, but it's three breaks to throw, and it means that Humphreys is throwing to get his first set of the match. Yeah, he's uh, done his masters in it, I suppose. The scoring is working tonight for Luke Humphreys for the first time in this tournament. He is going to need it to battle back from two sets down to Cullen. Double 14. He has the set. The third set. And a nod of the head from Luke Humphreys. Humphreys. The game is starting to coalesce for him. Oh, chance. Real chance here for Colin. Brilliant stuff. 180 number five. Leaves him single to double. Level 19 is not there. 93, Joe Uruguay, 48. So, make sure the 16, double 16 now, and Eight it's that easy. Leg, that break of throw means he's Four throwing leg, Joe, to be up 3-1 in Rupert. sets. It's definitely a big chance for Humphreys. To flip this set around again. For the 11 segment. Double 14. Oh, so close seven. to clearing 300 Joe points Uruguay, in two visits. Yeah, and oddly enough, there are no time plus finishes in this match, and we're pretty deep. There just aren't any. Oh, I couldn't help. <laughs> you tried. As did Colin, but it wasn't enough. Uruguay, Double seven Uruguay, now for 14. Humphreys. It's Eight, another break of throw. Humphrey. And now Humphreys is throwing for the set in a level game. This is how quickly. This is turning one way than the other. To throw first. Same fate. Humphreys with his nose in front. And again, a chance of a max. And this time he gets it right. He who sows the marker dart corn shall reap the points harvest, John Park. 41 for the set and a level game. Double 16. 25, Joe Uruguay, 161. Oh, 137. Luke Uruguay, Got the next 16. best. Left himself three darts at a double. Humphreys cannot afford to miss. It is a two set swing if he does potentially. He does not miss. It is 2-2. Two, two. 60. He is first to a finish, but Humphreys will get to something better. Would have loved another in there, but there's still big pressure on this. Could he? No, he couldn't, and Humphreys will get a look. Now, is this going to be regulation? Another little quick tidy up. An efficient clean kill. Yeah, two darter. And those two darters really make you feel efficient, good, like you can hit everything you look at, scoring even. Better than going for the, the 56, uh, the 156 out, because he might have ended up on double nine. Now he has double eight. And double four. Okay, double two. 12. And Cullen keeps getting these big outshot opportunities. And just can't seem to get a crack at a double on him. And he won't hear either. But Humphreys is already down to double two. We know they can be awkward. 42. Luke Uruguay, four. Double two. Can he find his way over that? Double one. No and score. Luke Humphreys has missed Do six set darts. Yeah, you know, twice he's one legs with a two dart treble, treble double combination, and then he misses six darts. And then Joe punishes him. Joe Cullen 
absolute thievery there. Punishment, whatever you want to call it. It's Joe forcing a fifth leg in this set with the throw now. And that for this set. That's probably for the best as well. No chance of leaving 10. We thought that in the last leg. Well, we did, and it is for the best. Just because it doesn't work out the way you think it does doesn't prove anything's right or wrong. Well, Humphreys isn't even there to apply the pressure. And that will do it for Colin. He takes the fifth set to the delight of his friends and family. And he only needs one more to take out the world number three. He's done that. He can still do this. Trouble 18. Leaves the bullseye. Oh, it would have been disgusting to win the leg like that. <laughs> but beautiful at the same moment. As with this. Couldn't get the travel. Would have left double 14. And Joe 54. Collins allowed back to the board Joe to level this set 27. up. Double 16. Double 8. Well, now Watson. he's in a real bit of trouble Luke now. Luke. He's up 2 0. He has the throw. And a set seven looks almost inevitable from this perspective. Wrong leg. Could switch things around. 82. Important again from Humphreys. Well, this would be the first ton plus out of the match. If he gets this ball. 96. Missed it in the last leg, missed it in this leg. Humphreys gets the travel. And the double, it's another regulation finish. He sweeps the set to nil and we are going all the way. What a contest. Three all in sets, it's 13-12 in legs to Humphreys. They're both averaging around about a ton. Can he take the opportunity? Beautiful. Double 10. 71. But he, Humphreys, this is an automatic 88. He's 88. hoping for one of those two dark things to happen. It's going to be more like hitting a bull. It's going to have to be the bull. Joe Cullen has 63. three darts to be in the 20. superb, supreme permission position. A golden opportunity. It's taken by Cullen. He will throw for the match. He has shown so little emotion. Humphreys feels pretty good about taking this leg now. Treble 19. Just the wrong side of the wire. 66. And, and if Luke takes this, he's back on throw at least and into the tie break situation or getting towards it if he holds. 60. Well, it leaves a bogey Luke number. Joe Collin has had a nightmare of a leg. When the match was there to be won, hey, it is still leg. there to be won. But he must break Humphreys here. Four Otherwise, leg. we're into that tiebreaker situation. It's got to be by two clear legs. Can he fill it up? To throw this into doubt. Yeah, well, just Cullen re the cards. He'll only get one dart at tops. And it's low, and Joe Cullen does get his chance. Joe require 93. Match darts, Cullen. He's missed them both. Oh, you can't believe this. Luke has to gather himself. That just Luke sent the adrenaline running 20. through him. He knows what he has to do, Luke and he does it. And now we are officially in the tiebreak situation. Looking pretty good for Cullen now because that is a much harder out than what he has already available. Another one of those where he's got to find his way past a block of dart, which he does to leave tops. And Joe Cullen does pin that one, no problems at all. Yeah, first ton plus finish of the match. It's another opportunity for Cullen. Set it up, take it out. 
and he can't do the Sick. setting up bit. Well, it's so hard when you're just in the leg that does it. You just try way too hard. You try to force it. And forcing the darts never results in success. This is a good visit. A good visit. We're going to require 100. Two tops. He has one and it's perfect. Oh, it's that. Saves the match. He must have thought surely he was going to get another chance to win. No need to go 20 and ball, which is why he went that route and he sets it up. Ton 40 would oh, remind Cullen that he's there in this leg. Yeah, now for double A. Dave got the leg, here we come. What an adjustment. Oh, that's the first start. Absolute beauty. Joe is a setup visit, pure and simple. And he leaves 50. Luke Humphries cannot keep pulling out these finishes, can he? Yes, he can. The composure, the ability to deal with Joe Cullen and the situation. Ramble and to hope. He is relying on the most reliable player in the world over the last few months. Missing to the 11s. To double 14. Oh, and that's the second time in a match he did exactly that on that number. 107. Double 16. 75. It's almost hard to believe he missed. It's all been so, so much like a fairy tale. Double two. Humphreys has the break. Humphreys has the dart. And Humphreys has the match in the palm of his hand. One leg in the two previous times. And let's not forget, he was down. He was down 2 0 in the set. The resilience. 140. Is he going to blink? No, he's not. This is astonishing. Luke Humphreys is going to get a chance to win the match. Cullen, can he find another treble? He can. He's going to leave himself something. Oh, that's amazing. And a 57-32, though, seems so simple to Luke Humphreys right now. But it's going to go back to the ball, or no, double five. They have both had a chance to win the match. Humphreys has just missed his. Cullen, the 1-3-2. Another in there. Oh, no, double 16. It's heartbreaking stuff. He's too bent right over. He cannot believe he missed that because he knows. He knows he can't expect to come back again. Double five. He's back. You can't write it. You can't make it up. You can't do anything. Cullen can force the last leg. All he's got to do is hit double 16. It's so simple. It's the simplest thing there is, except now. To go to the very, very end. Double four. Twenty-four. Who can hold it together? Luke required ten. Is it Luke Humphreys? No. Not shot. yet he can't. Wow. What a fantastic finish this is. Oh, and he's done the same thing Luke did when he was going for double five. First start bust on the adjacent double. So it's Luke Humphreys now back for double five. Who even deserves to win this? Who is going to win it? Joey requires. Somehow is back in charge. 
Joe Tuthrofa. How can these two produce their best in this leg after all that has oh. gone before? No, he's uh, it's too much, and he's unlucky not to get a 140. So there is opening for Humphreys. Can he be as? Oh, of course he can. This is silly. This is beyond belief. The nerves are jangling, but they're both hitting. 140. This is rivaling the great 11th leg between Barneveld and Taylor. This cannot be happening. Five perfect darts to start a sudden death leg after missing countless darts for the match. He survived countless darts for the match. And Colin. Well, he's left one, two, one. He'll have the first actual crack for the match here. Humphreys needs more. He needs more. 81. He leaves 100. Colin will not get a chance to win it in this visit. Oh. 41. Remember Humphreys with 100, Luke with the top's Luke top's Luke finish to save 100. the match. He did it to save it. Can he win it? Double 10.